It's hard to forget a mission like Rosetta. It had joy, emotion, a few tense moments and drama. After the Philae lander's seven-hour descent to Comet 67P, for instance, it bounced across the surface and went missing. But a few weeks before the mission ended, a member of the Osiris team struck gold. And I was the one who has found Philae in the images, so it was uh, amazing. And I still get goosebumps now whenever I talk about it. Philae provided views from a comet for the first time in history while the orbiter's Osiris camera took 100,000 images during the mission. All are archived. And despite Rosetta's official end three years ago, the science continues. 21 instruments studied Comet 67P, and in doing so, transformed not just our understanding of cometary science. Rosetta is, is probably one of the most important missions ever flown. Because it, it, it changed our perception on how the solar system formed, where the material comes from, which made the planets, and probably also how life started. Recently, scientists found new evidence connecting comet outbursts with cliff collapses and bouncing boulders. And at ESA's ESTEC site in the Netherlands, scientists at the final Rosetta Science Working Team, or SWT, meeting shared the latest analysis of their data. Any comments or questions? The teams had been really, really focusing on operations during that hectic period, the two years around the comet. So we needed that time, or this last three years after the end of the mission, to, to really make sure that we have the, the best quality data for, for the, 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 that is the legacy of the Rosetta mission. While some of the Rosetta scientists will remember its launch in 2004, for others it's been the start of their scientific career. When I arrived in the Midas team, I was still a student and I joined the principal investigator, the PI that was back then uh, operating the instrument. And I had the possibility to help him operate the instrument. Then I got some funding to do my PhD thesis, so to do some scientific analysis of the data. And eventually I even became the PI, the principal investigator myself. So this was an insanely steep career. And I think also a great personal development for myself and I think this was possible because the Rosetta team really embraced me and helped me to get where I am now and I'm very thankful for that. The next generation of scientists are now taking the knowledge they have gained from Rosetta onto future missions. Now that Rosetta is over obviously I'm going to continue doing the science because there's much that is left unexplored. Um, but uh, we do have another project uh, in mind, which is Comet Interceptor, uh, which is a really cool new mission that was just selected by ESA um, to intercept a dynamically new comet, so a comet that enters the solar system for the first time in its life. Rosetta's past, continuing science and influence on future scientists ensures that this extraordinary mission will not be forgotten.